Hi, this is Ramesh Babu. In this session, we will discuss about logical operators in SQL Server. So, what are the logical operators? So, these are or, and, in, not, between, like, person, like operator, exist, all, any. Everything, each and everything we will discuss with examples. Okay. So, let's start with R. For this, I will take sample table, select star from employee. So here, I want to display the employee details who are having salary equal to 3000. So in this case, I will write select star from employee where salary equal to 3000 okay and I want to display the employee details for comes under the department number 30 in this case we will write like this select star from EMP where department number equal to 30 okay so here we will we have to write two self queries for getting the records okay so one for salary equal to 3000 and another for department equal to 30 but by using our operator we can write only one self query within that we can write different types of conditions whatever we want like this okay if you write self query like this then we can get employee records who are having salary equal to 3000 and employee records who are having department number equal to 30 okay so that is about our operator so it returns true if any of the conditions separated by R is true, that means suppose if you don't have the records for salary equal to 3000, then simply it considers the records which belongs to department number equal to 30. Suppose if you don't have the records for department number equal to 30, simply it will consider the records which belongs to salary equal to 3000 okay so that is about our operator and what about the and operator and operator means simply copy this query and paste it and replace r with and here nothing will be displayed that means the employees are not available who are having salary equal to 3000 and department number equal to 30 okay so you can observe here also so salary equal to 3000 employees that are having department number equal to 20 and you can also observe like this department number 30 employees are not having 3000 salary i want to get employee records who are having department number equal to 20 then i will get five records okay suppose i want to get the department number 20 and salary equal to 3000 employee records then we can write like this salary equal to 3000 and department number equal to 20 so in this case these two conditions must satisfy then only records will be displayed that is about and r means any of the condition is satisfied then records will be displayed and means all conditions must be satisfied then only records will be displayed that is about or and operator next one is in 
true if the operand is equal to one of the list of expressions that means for example i want to get the employee details for department number 10 then we will write like this and again i want to get the employee details for department number 20 we will write like this i want to get the employee details for department number 30 we will write like this okay but i want to have a single query to achieve this functionality then what we will but no need to use r operator to achieve this functionality so we can use in operator to achieve this functionality that is select star from employee where department number in and we can put 10 in brackets then we will get department number 10 records if you put 20 here we will get department number 10 and 20 records if you put 30 here then we will get department number 10 20 30 records okay so here uh, if any of the department number records are not available in employee table then simply it ignores that department number then whatever the department number records are available it will simply displace that records for example if department number 30 records are not available then it will consider only 10 and 20 it will ignore 30 like in our employee table department number 40 records are not available okay so it will simply ignore that 40 number you can write 50 also no problem it will count will be same 14 only okay that is the purpose of in operator and not not means suppose i don't want department number 10 records then simply i will mention here 10 and then execute it i will not have department number 10 records okay i don't want department number 20 records also simply you put 20 so i will get only remaining records that is about not and next one is between between means suppose i want to have employee records who are, whose salary lies between 1000 and 2000 so in this case select star from employee where salary between 1000 and 2000 so here 1000 here we will get employee details whose salary lies between 1000 and 2000 that is between operator so it is true if the operand is within the range of comparisons okay and we can also use not between operator also like where salary not between 1000 and 2000 that means between 1000 and 2000 employee details will not be displayed what remaining employee details will be displayed here so between 1000 and 2000 records will not be displayed and next like like means true if the operand matches a pattern for example so here consider this employee name smith i don't know the complete employee name i know partial employee name okay in this case how to search this records 
by using the employee name. So select star from employee where employee name like. So here first one underscore. We will discuss about underscore. So I know partial name Smith. Okay, I don't know the exact spelling of employee name Smith. Okay, so in this case I will put underscore. So it will display Smith record. So it represents only single character. Okay, so percentage if you use percentage means it will represent 0, 1 or multiple characters. Okay, so for suppose if you know the employee name spelling SMI, for example, SMI, then in that case, underscore will not work. Okay, so in this case, you can use percentage, it will work. Okay, so you can put percentage here also. Okay, so like this. So here, observe this MI I have given. So MI lies in Smith employee name, MI lies in Miller employee name. Okay, if you remove M, then so these many employees are having I, I letter. Okay, that is the difference between percentage and underscore. Underscore represents a single character, percentage represents 0, 1 or more characters. And coming to exist. So, two tables, employee table, department table, okay. In department table, 10, 20, 30, 40 departments are available. In employee table, only 10, 20, 30 departments are available, okay. So, select star from DAPT where department number exist sorry where exist employ where DAPT number equal to 30 See what will happen. So here, this is the example query for exist. So here, what is the definition of exist? True if the subquery returns one or more records. That means if this subquery returns at least one record, then only we can able to get the records from department table. Otherwise, we won't get the records from department table. Okay. So that is the main purpose of exist. Okay. So this subquery returns at least one record. So here six records are there. So now I can able to get the records from department table so that I can fetch. So for example, here in employee table, department number 40 is not available. So I am giving department number 40. So now the so records are not displayed. Why? Because this subquery will not produce any records. Okay. So that's why it will display nothing. Next one is all. Before going to discuss about all and any, I am going to 
create another table for department number 30. So I am getting records from employee table and just inserting that I am getting records from employee table which belongs to department number 30 and inserted into another table like uh, employee number 30. So what will happen? Uh, employee number 30 it is already available. So no problem I will I am going to drop that table. So now by number I am going to move the department number 30 records to another table. Employee in employee table 14 records are available. In uh, employee 30 table 6 records are available. All records belong to department number 30. Okay. So all, all operator means it is true if all of the subquery values meet the condition. I am writing example query for this select star from employee where salary greater than all select star from sorry, select salary from EMP 30. So here it is very very simple just go through this employee 30 table here what is the maximum salary so 2850 is the maximum salary okay this query returns the records whose salary is greater than maximum salary of subquery Sal this query returns the records whose salary is greater than 2850 okay so observe this so all the records are having the salary which is greater than 2850 that is all operator okay that means all the subquery values meet the condition so all the subquery values meet the condition okay that is the next one is any any means it is here it is taking maximum salary okay it is now any means minimum salary so what is the minimum salary 950 okay so this query returns the records whose salary is greater than 950 okay so all these records salary is greater than 950 okay that is about any okay so that's the end of this logical operators or and in not between like exist all any okay so that's it. that's the end of this logical operators if this video is useful for you please give a like comment and share to your friends subscribe for more videos thank you